program is the Ghana Sustainable Change Program, and it's a service learning uh, based study abroad, and it represents a partnership between The Ohio State University, the Afinso North District, which is a local government area in Ghana, and the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology. And we all sat down with this African Development Support Initiative and our partners to talk about what did we want this partnership to look like. And one of the first things they mentioned is we have no uh, land use map of our district. So this rapidly growing area, the size of Franklin County, and there is no existing land use map. So the really important part is not only being able to build the map of the area, but being able to kind of look at developmental needs such as housing and food security um, and being able to, to map that and connect all of that data um, with the GIS system. It was really, really crucial. What's new has been certainly the iPad and the, the use of GPS, you know, satellite-based technology. You know, we're out in a rural area and yet we're able to instantly map where we, where we are. That might not have been possible just five years ago. And so our, our students working with the KNUST students managed to put their survey, a household survey, on into the app. And so instead of writing it down on pen and paper and having to transcribe it later, they, they could geocode the location of the housing survey, take pictures of the conditions of the housing, and input the survey results in real time in the app. And so by the time, we were only in country for a few weeks, so by the time we're, we were done in country, we had a, a database of a housing assessment in the, in the capital of Afinso North District. This is actually an ongoing project that started two years ago, and each year the students have been able to go back and add to the map. Um, and this is the first year that we were able to get iPads donated. Um, we were actually able to leave some behind, so the city planners there could continue to use it after we trained them to use the JS technology. You can realize your impact, I think. You know, when, when you go to a country or, or a community where the basic infrastructure is not present, so whether it's adequate running water, uh, roads, the things that we grow up with and we sort of take as what normal life is like here, um, to not see that and to, to work with people that don't have that, I think it shows, it shows you areas where we can improve um, and it's complicated, it's not an easy process, but to me, it, it, it demonstrated to me that I can, I can contribute to this positively. It's very much like the real world, where a city planner has to work with the community. They have to know the people, and I think that's the biggest lesson that we learned, is how you have to use all these different disciplines working together to really make any kind of sustainable change and development. It's the, it's the depth of the experience, the fact that people are willing to work outside of their silos, and that there's, you know, a can-do spirit here about getting things done. So I think all of those things are make this program possible and unique, really, to, to OSU. I think it's great for OSU. I mean, that's sort of, we are, at the end of the day, a public school, and it's about giving back for the, you know, for the better good and training young people and older people, everybody, to be um, better citizens and, and to know more about the world that they live in. And so by connecting uh, an urban area like Columbus, Ohio, with a lot of resources and education, access to, to all the different things you need um, to do good research, um, taking that to a, a, to a context where those resources might not exist, but the same uh, curiosity is there, the same intelligence is there, to me that's what a university is all about.